we have an organization called Born for Brothers, and it's the it's a slogan. It's called a, a friend of, is a friend of all time, and a brother is born for adversities. And so my journey with that is to be a brother to the brothers. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Um, to the men, uh, whatever stage, phase, situation you in, knowing that like we have somebody that can connect with you and walk with you. Mm-hmm. Like we walking with you. We all going through situations. We all going through financial hardships. Yeah. We all going through uh, emotional distress at times. And we all need somebody to talk to as as brothers. Mm-hmm. And and I want to just connect with the youth. I'm more so with the youth um, because it's easier to build a, a young person and to develop them into a strong human being yeah. than to tear down and rebuild a, a broken man. Yeah, you heard that saying, right? Um, and it's true because a man as a man, an um, older man as that's broken. His he he might his spirit might be broken. And that's something that some deep inner work. Yes, and it's like I—that's God's work. Yeah, that's not yeah. your job. That's not my job, right? Yeah. That's God's work. But a child whose spirit is not broken, whose spirit has is like pure, is mm-hmm. like you can take it and you can help him mold it, mm-hmm. and you know what I mean, and steal some things in it that he's going to need. And it's like now you can see him fly, yeah, and watch him fly wherever he goes, and it's like. That's more ins- inspiring. And so the younger people in my community, giving them something to aspire to mm-hmm. outside of rap, outside of playing ball, um, being a doctor, because I cut doctors, lawyers, and you can see these guys. They tangible. They've been where you at. Let's walk around with them. Let's, let's talk with them. Let's take them on trips. And I wanted uh, this following year... We want to take the young people over overseas because when I was younger, I never, I never, I, I didn't go to college, so I it was, it was no study abroad. I didn't, I didn't graduate from high school, so it was like I said, it was no study abroad. So if we could take that and send about ten to twenty kids next year away, that'd be dope. And then the following year is a hundred, a thousand. Just to inspire them, like just not just to see like America is America, but in different countries, you got Africa, you got, you know, you got, um, you got Italy, you got wherever, Dubai, Mm -hmm. you know what I mean? See how other people are living, their cultures, the way they, the way they move. Mm -hmm. That inspiration is going to carry them away from here. They're not going to, majority of them not going to come back and be the same person. That's my, that's my, that's my hunger. I'm hungry for that. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Um, so, you know, the business is to take care of my family, but so that way we can do more for the community. Yeah. If you were to leverage people, get more personnel, or get p- more people bought in, like, how can people help you? Uh, just sponsoring a child. Mm-hmm. I'm reaching out to um, at Born for Brothers DM on IG at Born for Brothers. And um, ask for Tremaine or myself, Joel, and ask them how to sponsor a child. Mm-hmm. You know, um, we'll give you the trip details and, um, you know, we'll give you a child and we'll let you know what child you're sponsoring and why and what is he doing for the community and what is he doing for school and his projected, you know, vision for his life. That's awesome. um, because that's what we that's what we help help with and just stop by the groom bar at the groom bar uh at the underscore groom bar underscore um check us out man we out here i got a phenomenal crew um they they amazing young people everybody's 25 and under and uh just come stop by and check them out yeah and you won't be you won't you won't be dissatisfied